the Jack Bauer Studios, free as for me. I hope everybody is having a good time, a good day. We are here on air to bring you some more exciting stuff here that has been in my inbox with regards to what type of antivirus do I use, what should we use, can we get this on our uh, devices that we have, and the answer is all yes, yes, yes. And I use the Avast myself, just to point that out, just the Avast right there. So let me bring you right to it so that you can see for yourself. Here's the Avast. I'll back it up right right now for you so you can see right here from as you can see there in your description here the PC magazine it will go through the best particular uh, viruses antiviruses and malware there's a big business going on see right there the best antivirus protection of 2017 all right the reason I'm showing it to you is because last thing that we want is for your particular devices to go into the toilet okay we don't want that is your box running slow is your uh, PC running slow. Have you picked up adware malware? It is a huge, huge business out there trying to uh, tag malware to every single program that you have on your PC, Android devices, your cell phones, etc., etc. So as you can see here, I use the one in the middle. This is my favorite because it will go to a free version. But here you can see that you got your choice from McAfee, Webroot, Bitdefender. I've used this one as well. Excellent program. It just runs my computer a little slow. So I have gone to this one because when this one expires, I'm screwed. I forget all the time. I need free. And when the free version comes around, this is it. So you can take a look for yourself. The malware scan, all of them do it. So that's what I need. Uh, on access malware scan, all of them do it. Website rating, uh, that's important to you. Mine doesn't do it, but I don't care less. Okay. A malicious URL. This is uh, what I'm going to show you here in the video why you want this and an antivirus on your particular programs. Um, it's crazy, crazy, crazy. I've also added a free version here to my Fire Stick uh, just so that it will kick back a code and protect me from uh, all kinds of nonsense. I side loaded this, just as an example. I put a side load on, okay? That's how you did it because you won't see anything in the, uh, in the, in the stores. Uh, you will see in the Google Play Store for you guys. So you have a Google Play Store. This is available, or you can side load the Google Play Store to your Fire TV, Fire TV Stick, Android devices, okay? So skipping right along, let's go right down to here. Let me show you real quick here. I'm going to show you something here. Big program. You don't have to read all. You can go back and read all this if you want. I'm just skipping through it because it just goes on. All it's telling you is about how malware is hosting URLs. Every site out there, they're trying to direct you to all kinds of nasty stuff uh, that will mess up your computer, get you in trouble. Uh, so what's the best? Um, you can take a look at everything for yourself. Just to give you an example, I've used the McAfee. I don't use it anymore. You can click on it, you can see to read the uh, full reviews if you're very interested in like what type of pr the pros and cons are associated with it. Um, the cons were in this particular one is so-so scores from independent labs, okay? And it'll give you the bottom line of the choice and testing. Um, I don't use this because I didn't. I don't find it blocking malicious URLs uh, or, you know, or the uh, malware is coming in. It lets it in first and then it wants to clean it. I can't have that. I need it to be blocked up front, like a firewall. I need it gone. So we'll skip back. We're going to show you here. Um, the web root one, again, it's $18.99. All they do is take you back to the website. It's hands-on for malware and adware block testing. Here's another one I was telling you about, the Bitdefender. Okay, you can click on the full review for the Bitdefender if you want to go back to the web root. Um, but if you're going to pick something, this is $20. Uh, it has a lot of pros, excellent scores. Um, the only you know downside is I would tell you just like it says here full antivirus scan took a long time it does it does uh, like flipping all day all day I couldn't have that so I had to unload this one okay the other second thing I had is my con that I'll just post along to you if you did buy this they automatically recharge your credit card and you got to go fight them because it won't be $19.99 they're gonna charge your credit card like $79.99 so I had to fight with them so after that forget it I decided to fire them. No longer, I said, I don't want any automatic payments. Uh, Norton, I don't use that anymore. The uh, cast, this is the number one here, right here, the cast. Okay, so let's go to the cast. This is most popular, this is most recommended by every coder that's out there that want to use this. It's fantastic scores. 
And the cons were for this one, it's so, so scores on our hands on. Malware blocking and malicious URL testing, okay? So that's a big deal to me and what I do with regards to testing and adding new builds, adding new add-ons. So that's a huge one for me. So I've had zero problems with uh, my Avast. That's why I'm using that one, this one right here, this Avast. So let's skip along to this one, show you the full review, and then we're going to show you some testing for yourself, today, just so that you can see. Okay, so here's the Avast, okay? I did not pay $39. I actually forget to pay it, so I used the free version back and forth. If I can't get it for $20, I'm going with free. It has excellent scores, too. It's a password manager. The cons were slow malware scan. Uh, I didn't think an hour, maybe an hour and a half was too long. I could deal with that myself. The password manager is limited. Again, I don't care. I'm not trying to put a password on everything in my computer. Some hardened browser features didn't work in uh, testing. Uh, so then you added this thing up here called Adblock Yourself. Okay? That's free. See? Free. So, I mean, it's very effective found in the Avast Free Edition, just like I told you. Same effective protection found in the Avast Free Edition. So free is for me. If you're going to go with something and you don't have anything now, just remember that. Okay? You'll get protection. It will it will bring you right through it. This is what you know is recommended. So let's jump right into a test. Okay. So what do I mean for people like us that are using like Kodi, HBO Go Online, Netflix, um, add-ons like Exodus, one, two, three, open load. Okay. So open load is a huge deal and huge, huge. Everybody's like, oh, you gotta have open load. I want to pair it. Why are you telling people not to pair it? You know? That's my choice. You do what you want. Let's go click on um, an open load here. Let's just pick one of them. All right, so here's an open load. Just be careful. Be forewarned. A lot of times when I click on this stuff, uh, your kids are using this thing. It takes you directly to porn, okay? So be very, very careful. This will take you a lot of times directly to malware, adware of porn. So I'll click off if it does. But as you can see here, it's redirecting me. I'm going through all kinds of nonsense. It's trying to take over my browser, okay? I don't want any of this stuff. So we will uh, click on it again and see if it plays. Here we go again. See, it's trying to take over my browser right before your eyes. It's trying to hack me. It's trying to get back in. I'm not going to accept anything here. So you get the idea, right? So you can uh, decide for yourself. I mean, it's a complete hijacking uh, tool that's out there. So let's get out of the open load. Let's just type in something like HD movies, okay? Let's just type anything, see what comes up. Um, we'll just pick anything. The first one, HD movies, okay? This is another add-on that goes into your Kodi. Okay, HD movies, you've seen that link. Um, if you don't have it, that's what it is. It just says HD movies. So let's click on Britney, whatever that is, okay? Let's see what happens. Let's see if this is clean. All right, it's giving me the screenshots. Everything is looking okay. So let's see. Here we go again, the hijacking of that URL. There we go. It's trying to grab me again. Critical alert. Critical alert from Microsoft. Malware, 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 malware. Okay, you see how you can't even get out of it? You're trying to take me to the, the Pornhub stuff. So look at that. I'm blocked. It's, it's, it's trying to kill my, my tablet. Your computer, has, Your computer alerted has alerted us that it is infected with the virus. Okay, so the only way out of this is Control, Alt, and Delete. You're going to go to your task manager. And then I'm going to look up Chrome. I'm going to end the task. I'm going to get out of this thing before it kills my computer. But that's the main reason why you want this particular um, antivirus, as you can see there. That Let's see if my Chrome is okay. I'm going to open up one more time. Because a lot of times, if you don't do it right, you click on the wrong thing, it's over. Okay, they got your, uh, they got your browser. I don't want to restore any pages. They're trying to even get back into there. Let's get back here to Yahoo. I don't want to do any of that. All right. So I got out of there just in time. All right. Cool, cool, cool. So once again, just so you can see before your own very eyes, a lot of people don't know what to do. But that's just like an important thing that I'm trying to show you guys. That um, whatever device you're using, people tell me that their Fire Sticks don't work. Your Android boxes don't work. Uh, your computers don't work. You can't get your Kodi to work. And once one of those malware or adware attacks you, it's... <laughs> You're back to the toilet because you don't know what the deal is. You're stuck, okay? 
So get this, even if you have a problem, and then start running scans in your PC, in your, uh, your tablets, your phones. Just do that scan, whatever one you're going to use, even if it's a free one. Just let it go. Get rid of these uh, viruses. And uh, I'm going to suggest, as always, whether you use my settings or somebody else's settings, but make sure like an Exodus, um, Zen, stuff like that, that you use. Like my particular settings where I'm wiping out a lot of these uh, streams that are bad, just like I showed you. That's the reason I'm showing you today, just to protect my Jack Bauer subscribers. Okay, that's it. I highly suggest if you can, share this video with all of your friends and neighbors, just so that they can see at the end of this video, middle of the video, the, how the malware just attacks and ruins your uh, device. Okay, I don't want that to happen to you, so that's the only reason why I'm showing you this antivirus 2017 program. So you can see for yourself what happens with the uh, the websites and the add-ons that go directly that are not fixed. I don't recommend you try this yourself. Um, I feel very bad if you guys destroy your computer. So just watch my example here and then uh, go pick any sort of antivirus or free one that you so desire. All right, guys. Enjoy.